Wow, you know, it feels weird to be in here but not working. Yeah, and it feels weird to not get our discount. Chloe, aren't you like a millionaire? What? No, my parents are the millionaires. I, on the other hand, love a good discount. Anyways, so Georgia, now that summer school is over, are you still gonna be splitting your time between Baywood and Uptown School of the Arts? Yes, absolutely. I love both schools so much, I couldn't imagine just going to one. That has to be way too much homework. <gasps> Our rings. Majesty must need us. I wonder what it could be. Only one way to find out. All the other bunglers are off working on some secret mission. Oh, I hate feeling left out of things. I'm an asset. I have great qualities for a bungler. I wish they saw that. I bet they never let each other feel left out. <gasps> Wait! Maybe if I create some colorful minions, they'll see how great I am. This is gonna be fun. But how should I lure the pops to me? This thing might come in handy. Hey, Majesty, what's the sitch? Is there an update on Flash? No, there hasn't been any progress. Don't worry, Cheshire, I'm sure we'll hear something soon. I was thinking. Oh, really, me too. I had this idea. It requires a lot of baloney, uh, like a ton. Cheshire? So, as I was saying, I was thinking that we should probably reach out to the K-Pops and find out if there's any update on Flash's whereabouts. Oh, that's a great idea! They'll for sure know something. Not as good as my baloney idea, but it could work. Alright then, I'll reach out to Flower Pop now. <gasps> oh, my ring. Better make sure the coast is clear. Hello? Anybody here? Anybody? In the flower shop. Perfect. Hello, Majesty? Fiona, I was hoping you might be able to come up to the spaceship and help us out with something. Of course, anything for you, Majesty. Perfect, I'm teleporting you up now. <gasps> hey guys! <laughs> flower Pop, thank you so much for coming. No problem. So, what's the sitch? Hey, Cosmic says that! I love this for you guys. Flower, when was the last time you spoke to Flash? Uh, it's been a few weeks, I think. Oh, um, well then I'm very sorry to tell you, but Flash Pop is missing. What? Incarnation? Yeah, that was our same reaction. Do you have any idea where she could be? Uh, she hasn't been in contact with the K-Pops in a couple of weeks. And if she's not with you, then I really have no idea where she could be. Now, now, don't worry. We'll get to the bottom of it right now. You as well. I have Celeste running diagnostics to find out if there's any energy footprint from her. So we'll get to the bottom. Maybe if I just push this, they'll come. Ow! That shocked me. Tests have been concluded there was an energy spike roughly matching her powers at the abandoned warehouse. Another abandoned warehouse? Weren't we just at one? They all look the same. Yes, but you know how much Flash loves spooky things. All right, Pops, Shishai, well, your Pop. Let's get ready to go, shall we? Teleporting you to the coordinates now. Wait, you're not Flash. Wow, great job. Where'd you get this one from? Who are you? Why don't people know who I am? My name is Catastrophe. She used to be a student at Baywood named Amber. What are you doing here? Bungling around. And I found this. Thought I'd give it a whirl. That doesn't belong to you. Give it back. Perhaps. But first, I need something from you. Watch out! right meow. Things just never work the way I plan. Flower, are you all right? Yeah, just a little dizzy, like a dandelion. <laughs> I should be fine. My apologies, everyone, but if she did use the ring, that would explain the energy spike. We need to get back to the spaceship at once. The spell should start working right about now and will be irreversible by midnight. Oh, 
I wish it didn't just work on one of the pops. I'd rather have an army. Now all I have to do is wait. Find something to pass the time. Just a little bit longer, Flower Pop. Celeste is almost done scanning you and then we'll be able to tell if Catastrophe's powers affected you. Didn't you just upgrade her system? Shouldn't this be a lot faster? Does she seem a little grouchy to you guys? Well, she did say that she was feeling a little dizzy. Uh, or maybe she's hangry, like you get sometimes, Cosmic. <gasps> I do not! Oh, snack time! Bad time. What are you guys whispering about over there? My hearing just weirdly got a lot better. Guys, I think there's something on her head. Is that normal? Whoa, flower! Oh, on your head you have like, what, a cat ears? <laughs> what? I have fuzzy ears? What is happening to me? Oh, oh dear. <laughs> flower, how are you feeling? <coughs> Stop asking me so many questions! No wonder Flash ditched you guys. Ah! Scanning inconclusive. Multiple anomalies detected. This cannot be good, Pops. I need you to keep an eye on her. Uh, Spike, I know I put a love spell on you, but OMG! Hey, Flower. How's it going? <laughs> How does it look like it's going? I have cat ears growing out of my head. Well, they look really cute. And they match your hair nicely. Here I was trying to protect you guys, and I am the one who has to pay for it? <gasps> it should have been you! <gasps> Flower? What? I mean, Glow, you could have shot your sun powers at her, and Gold, you could have distracted her with your shine powers, but did you do that? No! And look at me now. Come on, Gold, let's give Flower her space. I think I've given it enough time. Let's check and see how Flower is doing. Who is calling me? I don't recognize this number. What? Hey there, cool cat. It's Catastrophe. How you holding up? I have cat ears. <laughs> Ooh, fun. Isn't it amazing how much better you can hear? I guess. And they're fuzzy. I don't know. I just, I feel like, duh, never mind. It's okay. You can tell me. I don't feel like I fit in anymore with the pops. Maybe you've outgrown them. Why don't you come hang out with me? But I'm not a bungler. I can't hang out with you. That's all right. Just come hang out. Hmm. I guess it would be nice to get a little space from them. <laughs> Fine. I'll meet up with you. Yes. Has anyone seen Flower? Yeah. And it was not a pleasant experience. She said some really not nice things. Hey, where's Cheshire? Um, I sent him to go check on her, but... This cannot be good. Well, why not? Well, think about it. She was hit with bungla magic and then she grew cat ears, but now she's not acting like herself. I'm afraid she may be turning into a bungla. <gasps> what? It is of the utmost <clears throat> importance that we keep an eye on her because if it is a spell, we don't have that much time to reverse it. Majesty! I went to go look for flower, but she's nowhere to be found but I did find his taco. Oh, wait, where no, has she gone? Oh, my God. Oh, dear. Celeste, can you scan the spaceship for flower? Scanning. Scanning. No results for flower pop. Oh, no. Pops, we must split up and try and find the antidote for her at once. This spell is taking over and much more quickly than I originally anticipated. Any luck, guys? None here. Uh, you know, good thing I used to run this place and they never changed the passcode. Oh, gosh. <gasps> Wait, you guys, I think I found something. Oh, just rubber chicken. 
Must have been from the doodler's room. Who? Uh, oh, wait, you guys, there's something in this box. Great job, is there an antidote in there? Let's see, balding potion, sneezing potion, dream potion, bad breath potion. Nope, no anti-bungla potion in here. I hope the other group is having more luck than we are. Oh, come on, take it. No. They won't notice. No, I don't want to do that. Why are you trying to get me to steal coffee? Because it's fun. And their drinks are overpriced anyway, so it's like getting even. No, 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 I will not do it. Oh. Okay, fine. I have a better idea. <gasps> wow, there's so much stuff in here. He should be on the show holders. No kidding, but I'm not seeing anything that looks like a potion in here. No, you're right. Only shrunken heads, voodoo dolls, and sage. <gasps> Wait, there's no voodoo dolls that look like us, right? Oh, I didn't even think to check. One second. Nope, all clear. <laughs> Catastrophe, why did you bring me here? I needed a little spending money since you refused to steal a cup of coffee. <gasps> Catastrophe, I don't think you understood my point. Ugh. Oh, it's so loud. Hey, will you hold on to this for me real quick? Oh, I will not be an accomplice to robbery catastrophe. <laughs> I'm out of here. Is she for real? Flower, come back here right meow. Flower. Oh, this has been the worst day ever. I just don't feel like myself. <laughs> what is this? Where is my green hair? What is happening to me? Flower, this isn't you. How do you know this isn't me? Maybe I'm different now. No, you're under a spell and it's close to your heart. And if we don't stop it before it gets to you, you'll turn into a bungler completely. I don't like this, please help me. <laughs> like you can, it's too late Super Pops. Finally, you'll all go down once and for all. <gasps> We can't shoot back, she's one of us. Quick, uh, tell her about all of her good qualities and that way we can stop her heart from turning bad. Good thinking, Majesty. <gasps> Flower, your optimism is contagious. <gasps> You're one of a kind. You have a heart of gold. <gasps> and I would know. <laughs> Flower, <gasps> your color is green and that's my favorite color. <gasps> Majesty, I can feel it taking over me. <laughs> Working. I think she's listening. All right, Pops, I think that we should try and break the spell with the power of song. Flower Pop, I want you to concentrate on the words and how strong our friendship is. And if you can, sing along with us. Ready? Okay, I'll try. I guess you did it. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, we couldn't have done it without you and we're so glad that you're back. How about we get out of here before we run into catastrophe? <sighs> that sounds good. I'll poof us out. Thank you. <gasps> Finally, no more cat ears on my head. And your hair is back to normal. Well, well not normal, but uh, gr green. It's green. Flower, we are so happy to have you back. Thanks, and thank you for not giving up on me. We would never do that, and we knew it wasn't you. You were under a spell. Only because you sacrificed yourself for us. Thanks for saving us, Slay Girl. Flower, because of your bravery and because of your heroism, I want to make you a super pop. Well, what do you say? Wait, really? <laughs> yes, I mean, I'd love nothing more. I, I am honored. Oh, oh, <gasps> can we do the thing? <laughs> super pops, we can't be stopped. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you check out other videos from us here at Totally TV.